got a chance for the in-swinger here from Rapid Vienna. The penalty box is packed. A high line from the Celts just on the 18-yard line. Mogru and Van Dijk issue the orders. It's a ball in here. It's into the middle, Van Dijk! And heartbreak for the boys. As Rapid Vienna take the lead under the worst circumstances. The ball coming off the head of Virgil van Dijk and pass, look at Zaluska. So a chance for one of our three dead ball specialists here, Mugru, Stokes and Commons stand over the ball just now. It looks like it could be Chris Commons with a thunder strike. It's just over the bar. What a hit. And the Celts are asking for a corner there, but again, if ever we needed a reminder, Mark, of why he has Celtic's player of the year, there it is right there. What a hit. We saw a few things last season, probably most notably in that game against Shakhtar Karagandhi, when he scored that all-important goal just before the break. So far, the Celts seem to be building from the back. Berem Kayal now looks for the run of Stefan Johansson, who's making tracks in this right-hand side, but that's a lovely touch by Schaub. Schaub now inside left channel, rolls it out to Hoffman. What a save by Lucas Soliska. He read it every step of the way and parried it away for the first corner of the game. Wonderful stuff there from our Polish goalkeeper. Soliska, back to Mogru. Van Dijk. Bring Johansson into play. Chris Commons. Celtic knocking the ball about. Nice and quick. But just looking for that penetrating pass. And here it is. Anthony Stokes is onside. Support from Barakta. It's Der Barakta. And Der Barakta has knocked it past the wrong side of the post. To the disbelief, I think, of everyone in the stadium. I think in fairness to the Dutchman, the ball just seemed to bobble slightly as it was squared to him. But that was excellent build-up play from Celtic with Anthony Stokes. <laughs> Stefan Johansson, back now to Charlie Mogu. A number of the Celtic substitutes warming up here. And Mark, I have to agree with you, I think. Perhaps on our Mark will be a chance to see an introduction of some of the substitutes, but it's comments! Well, Mark, you have to forgive me there. I thought he was going to take a touch. But a chance now for Rapid from distance. As Lucas Zaluska organises his wall. It does look like we're going to see something of the spectacular from distance. Stepping Zaluska. And at the second attempt. Well held by the Polish goalkeeper. <laughs> it's certainly an ambitious effort from Thanos Petsos. Got it up and over the wall and just dipped at the right moment. Rafa just knocking the ball about, inviting Celtic on. Berant. The ball dinked forward now. Well brought down. Chance for a shot here, it's rolled into the middle. Schwab! And just over the bar, Louis Schwab going for his best turn and shot effort there. And luckily for the boys, it was just over the bar, but it was the inviting and penetrating run there by Philip Schubesberger coming off the left-hand side and eventually it fell to the number 10, Louis Schwab. Touch from Kyle now. Another spin there from the Israeli. Releases Adam Matthews. Matthews with space in front. Early ball for Amido. Pukki's there, it's Timo Pukki! The second attempt is Pukki! It's a goal for Celtic. Stunned silence here in Vienna. And the Celts have equalised through their flying bin, Timo Pukki. He's just looked so much more up, upbeat. It looks like he's in a new lease of life. And, uh, you know, that was a, that'll give him a lot of confidence going forward. First shot was blocked by the keeper, 
we remained calm and was able to tuck away at the second attempt to bring Celtic level in this match.